Hi, welcome to AirTV. I've got Kletcher with me. We've just drawn 2-2 two -two here at the Emirates. Did you just say we just won 2-2? Two -two? No, we've just drawn 2-2. Two -two. Drawn? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, sorry. I'm not, I'm, hey, this feels like a loss more than a draw. Let me tell you that. This one, this one's hurting me. But yeah. today I had hospitality, big up Doha Insurance Group. I was watching it. Shane wasn't three points. It was 2-2. Two -two. But Kletcher, your thoughts on today's performance? I'm brother. <laughs> My brother, and everything gives thanks to God, you understand? God help me higher. Hey, My brother, in everything, eh? Once there's life, there's hope. In everything, first of all, give thanks to God. First of all, let me big up my boy, Edin Ketia. The amount of disrespect that this kid is facing, mm. this 24 year old kid, is my brother, that he's facing in this squad. I'll be amongst the fan base. It's, uh, it's, 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 uh, it's astonishing. It looks like people don't actually, if you don't know football, just keep quiet. Mm -hmm. It's disrespectful. The first two games he has played very well. Everyone was calling for him to be dropped. For what reason? He came on now, he has scored. He has been, he, he worked hard. In fact, for the highlight for me was when they gave him their captains, the band. Mm -hmm. So the haters will cry. You understand? Mm -hmm. We are here, we are on ground. Nothing did happen. The boy will start going forward. He Amen. showed today. Amen, my brother. He showed today. Mm -hmm. His class showed today. What else do you guys want? Mm -hmm. That's number one. Number two, I think I'm done with the tinkering of this squad now. You understand? Like the but manager. Why, Eddie might not have started because the manager tried something different by putting trust No, there. no, 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 no. And we had this interview against West Ham, remember? When I gave the example. <laughs> yeah, I mean. Remember the example? <laughs> Bro, <laughs> come on. He's going to he's playing against um Tosina De Bruyne, yeah. those huge guys that are yeah. that are like double his size. How do you want to pin them? You're not that physical, bro. But you see, when he came on, he was pinning them. And that's what Jesus does as well. You pin defenders. Do you understand? Trusa cannot do it with all due respect. He can come in as an impact sub there once in a while, but he cannot start. But he might be able to receive the ball away from the defender, which could be different to what Eddie does. No, sometimes Eddie does, does go out there. So Eddie is simi more similar mm -hmm. to a Jesus than Trossard. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Okay, okay. You have to occupy the defenders, and it worked. Mm. And he has the pace to latch onto the ball as well. So play him. That's number one. Number two, I'm tired of the tinkering. <laughs> I'm now. I'm done with. No, I'm not even tired. I'm done with the tinkering because it's now like, come on, bro. Like, what tinkering are you annoyed with? What, what's frustrating you the most? The frustration the is party playing on yes. right, right back. Thank you. That's the main frustration for me. You understand? Two. What has Gabriel done? I need to know what Gabriel has done. Come out and tell us what Gabriel has done. Did he hand in a transfer request? Did he come late to training? We need to know. Because Kiria cannot be playing ahead of Gabriel. I got Gabriel, told he was fine today. I was next to his family and he said everything's fine with him, but they didn't say anything was going on. Do you understand? He didn't even come on when we needed to close the game out. Do you understand? He came on against Crystal Palomino when we needed to close the game out and he played well. So these are the things that we need to, you know, talk about. Yeah. The manager is a great manager. He's doing very well. But that doesn't mean that we cannot criticize him positively. That doesn't mean that we cannot get into question one or two decisions that I'm not comfortable with. Mm. You see the Gabriel one? You see the party one at right back? Uh, bro, I'm not comfortable with it. Number three, big up Fabio Vieira. Yeah. I thought this was the coming of Fabio Vieira. If that goal had entered, bro, I would have been somersaulted. <laughs> Honestly, that Shangalo that he did, that, you yeah. understand? Yeah. Karate kick, bro. But he played well, Thank assisted one, won the penalty. Brilliant. Mm. So I like my people to talk. Okay, let me ask you about Eddie and Ketu. Are you agreeing with Kletcher that you know he's getting unfair, you know, judgment? I agree with um, um, Kletcher. And Ketu should be given space and opportunity to play. Mm. The, why did Why did you resign him if you know you are not going to give him that opportunity? Mm. Jesus is not available. Let him play. Why are you playing covered ahead of him? When you know you have a potential uh, striker that can deliver. And when he came in today, we saw what he did. Mm. It's obvious for everybody to see that confidence, that agility, that, you know, hunger, you know, to make something happen. He did today. And, and I think people should respect him. You understand what I'm saying? We should respect him. If Jesus is not playing, then Ketia should be playing ahead of even Kavat. Kavat needs to learn the Arsenal way. How many, how many, how many, how many games has, has he played with the team? You need to learn. Then you bring him in. Don't, don't start him ahead of Inketia. I feel it's not good. Let me ask you to finish up. Who is your favourite player today for Arsenal? Saka. Saka. Yeah, Saka. I really like Saka. Yeah, fair, fair enough. Well, thank you very much, people. Good to see you. Love, 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 love.